All right, so here we are in Unity. Uh, you can see I quickly modeled a, a small room with some stuff in it, so we can look around. Um, I'm go ahead, gonna go ahead and uh, start by playing this, and this is going to create our player uh, into the scene. Um, this is actually not just running locally; this is running on the Photon Cloud. So uh, this is this has created a lobby and a room from which we can connect uh, other clients. So if I open this client up, then once it starts up, I'll join into the room, and now you see there are uh, two avatars in there. So if I go ahead and move around here. Uh, whoop, closed it there. Just get it out of the way like that. As I move around here, you can see it's both moving around there and on the, uh, the Unity game. The echo you're hearing right now is the um, audio, the voice recording. So there's voice chat set up also. Um, and since I'm connected to myself, it's talking to myself and giving some echo. Uh, now these are both running the VRTK, um, uh, what's it called? The simulator rig, which simulates a camera rig. Um, so if I go into the player, I can move around with the arrow keys, not very realistic, but um, what I can do now is leave that room. Uh, this other player is still going to be in, in this uh, room playing the game, but uh, I can go back and change it from the simulator to make SteamVR the primary uh, VR rig, and when I play this then it will go on my headset. So now I've joined, now I've joined it, it in VR. VR. You can see through the game view. Uh, Here's my, Here's my game view in VR. I can see the other player. If I actually click in here, I can move them into view. So that we can see now. Right there. Yeah, quite frightening. So here's uh, the VR network avatars working with uh, Photon 1 in Unity.